Last time on Persona 3 Reload. We really appreciate this. We'll have the school talk to your parents to resolve any issues. Akihiko and Mitsuru have the biggest mum dad vibes ever. They're like sitting on the couch with their arms crossed looking at the girl. It's almost like she's in trouble. And Junpei, Yukari, and the MC are just sitting on the other side, almost like they're, you know, in trouble. Like the two parents are sitting on the comfy chow on the couch, while like the three kids in trouble are sitting on those little blocks. It's it's pretty funny. It's yeah, the vibe is just out there. Good morning. Well, that just happened! That was one of the worst scenarios we could have had! Angels are somewhat impartial, watchers are somewhat impartial, and rapers are basically judging you for everything that you do. Great, I got the worst of the three. I just love how Akuma just had to see a skull and instantly knew it was death. Death Arcana and P5 was talking me, the doctor. Yeah, because she kept ejecting me with experimental drugs. She could have killed me at any time. She probably killed several people that way. She's docked the death. The definitions of Pharos. A tower with a light that gives warning of shoals to passing ships. Synonyms. Beacon. Beacon light. Lighthouse. Example. Light of Pharos. Why do I automatically think the river sticks? With the bloody, you know, the fairy man. Great. We met death. Well, isn't that lovely? That's Charon. Karen. Yamagishi will be living in the dorms with us starting today. And from this point on, she'll be providing us with support in Tartarus at night. That means I can start joining battles again. That's reassuring. Don't push yourself. Yes. Well, you see, you'll see. Even if I'm a bit slow starting out, rest assured that I'll catch up to you in no time. I know this is sudden, but the chairman will be coming by again this evening. Can I get a Tartarus, please? I'd like everyone to gather at the usual place tonight. I just want to do some battle battle. Come on. It's been like a week. I need to kill something. He just came by the other day. Something happened? Be patient, Kuma. No! Apparently, he's prepared some special gifts for us. Are they guns? They better be guns. I know it'll be busy with Yamagishi moving into the dorm, but I'd appreciate it if you could all come by. It's a welcome party, isn't it? No, he's gonna start selling his lame jokes. No, I don't want to hear that shit. Special. Does that mean we can expect something good? No, it's gonna be lame. I don't know. This is Ikutsuki-san we're talking about. Yep. He's probably just gonna tell us some new joke he made up. Yes, it's gonna be horrible. Oh, thank god they didn't use up my time slot. I was actually worried they were gonna use my time slot for crap. Yay! <laughs> we met a reaper! <laughs> Funnily enough, I met a reaper once or twice in my life. That was a terrifying fucking experience. Anyways, quick little break. Well, Akuma, I'd recommend before doing a social link, I'd talk to Yuko first and then decide and then decline her request to hang out before the option to hang out, since I believe she will tell you about a new potential social link near her, like rank 4. Like how Kenji told you about the chubby student and then you got him rank 2 or 3. Since you have a rank 4 courage, you could start the link instantly. Oh, that's cool. Wondering when they got the execution part from. Nani, Kuma, play Bullet by Hollywood Undead. I actually listen to Hollywood Undead. They're actually pretty cool. I like them. All right, let's do a quick break. Break time. Okay. So, fun little fact. Did you know that women have more Alt F4 attempts than men, but men overall have more Alt F4s? Do you know why?
because typically women attempt it through things such as pills and you know slitting and things like that and men typically use things like shotguns one has a higher probability of surviving than the other also hanging men typically use hanging so even if they change their mind it's usually too late it's an alright song not something I listen to this is one of their more they've had too many drink songs Tokubetsu Kagai Katsudo Bu Special Extracurricular Activities Department Well, society hates men also Well, yeah, like, yeah <laughs> If a guy says he's feeling depressed, people laugh at him Like, you remember the guy that I worked for who was my neighbor and also my first employer? He hung himself in his restaurant and I met a real estate agent that he had and um, she was basically selling his apartment and I went to check it out and then I basically said oh I knew him like whatever she's like oh yeah really sad and I'm like yeah like no one could have seen it coming and she basically said oh yeah the last time I saw him he was telling me he was really depressed and I was thinking at the back of my mind this guy basically told you that he was depressed and you ignored it because the guy ended up like dating this woman they had a kid and then she broke up with him and she basically was keeping the kid and so it was like really messy and so this guy came from Serbia worked his ass off for like 25 years made something of himself finally had enough time to like date someone and have a kid first thing that happens after the kid is born she leaves him she gets custody of the kid and the guy's just like I'm gonna you know neck myself and he literally did and his real estate agent when he was selling his apartment he was telling her that he was depressed and she just ignored it that was literally a cry for help and she ignored it like welcome to the west no one gives a shit no one cares they'll take your business but like they don't give a fuck and they don't feel about it either it's like yeah no one could have possibly seen this come I'm just like fuck man welcome to the west ladies and gentlemen yeah now you see why I'm so um receptive to cries of help I'm very uh perceptive of them dear Kuma I hope I'm not disturbing your afternoon do you have time to meet well like do you actually want to level up our relationship? Giggity. No leveling up of our relationship? What is this? I'm glad there won't be a full moon for a while, but still, I can't help thinking about it. I, it must suck to be a bully. You have to pretend to be nice so no one gets suspicious. And if someone finds out, you have to be even nicer to them. I thought the role of a bully was to be an asshole to everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk to Yuka. I got it. He's usually on this floor somewhere on the other side. I'm gonna save the game just in case. Oh, oh Kuma. Uh, you know about the night time at Poloina Mall, right? I've, I've never really cared for it since the place seems kind of sketchy. I hear a weird crowd hangs around there. Like there's some guy dressed as a monk partying hard every night. There's no way he's a real monk, right? Are monks even allowed to drink alcohol? I got a lead from Yuko about a monk who parties hard in a nightclub. <laughs> this sounds like my type of guy! <laughs> By the way, are you heading out soon? I was thinking about what to do since there's no practice today. Seems Yuko wants to walk home together. I don't think our bond will cl grow closer. Never mind. Oh, did you already have plans? I guess you do seem busy. We'll see you around. A monk in a nightclub. He must be the guy that was going. He was high as a kite, man. Hey, I saw this girl last time in front of the station. She was wearing a frilly white dress. It was like white goth. 
Is it getting hot to be wearing those? Isn't it getting hot to be wearing those kinds of clothes? She must be seriously devoted to her look. There's no way I could pull that off in the weather. You know, I was in Tokyo and I went with my mate and I forget what it's called, but it's that really popular shopping district where they had it in Juju Kaisen where it's like the gate and the gate at the bottom and there's like this massive street down the hill and there's stores everywhere. Anyway, we were there and it was like summer. Japanese summer with humidity. Harajuku, that's the one. Japanese summer, humidity. I am wearing a shirt and shorts and I am sweating, right? It's humid as fuck. And then there's these two girls walking past us like decked out in Victorian era like goth clothing black dark purple multiple layers and obviously umbrellas in the middle of Japanese summer with maximum humidity and I'm just like how the fuck how the fuck are you wearing that how and secondly, why? <laughs> and they just like casually walk through. And there's a lot of stores there for like, you know, um, accessories and whatnot and all that stuff. And I guess there's, it's sort of like a fashion district and people, you know, buy stuff and everything. But at the same time, the humidity was through the roof. You must be sweating in that thing. Like Jesus Christ. I've heard that some of those outfits are kind of light, but it does depend on the material. Well, sunlight and dark, like black, would absorb, you know, heat. Though, I do remember, I was like, I was walking back to the gym one time. And I was walking back, because I would walk there, it's like 20 minutes, and walk back 20 minutes. And I'm walking back, and this is after a session, so I am drenched in sweat. And this was summer. And then there was a goth girl, like full decked out goth, makeup, lipstick, boots and everything, right? Like full vampire. And I'm just there drenched. And I'm waiting to cross the road. And she's also waiting across the road. And then I just like take a look at her like this, you know, like I'm standing there and she walks up and she's waiting for the road. And in the corner of my eye, I basically see like pitch black and white face. I'm like, what the fuck? And there's this goth girl. And she gave me this biggest, like, what the hell are you looking at? Sort of like, look, you know what I mean? Like, don't you judge me. You're not my dad. And I'm just like, oh, okay. And she's like, what? What are you looking at? I'm like, nothing. I was just thinking you look pretty cute for a vampire. And she was like, oh, okay. And then the light went green and that's it. Uh, I went through a phase. Went through a phase. Alright, let's do more of this. Yep, yep. I guess duplicate physical. We're fine with these. Who do I have to sleep with for more SP? I'm technically supposed to be spending time with people in school. I think this is the one that helps me improve my relationship with people. Yeah, so what can be done here? Learn academics. Time will pass if you make an offering. Wait, so it's just academics? F off. Fortune, relationship, fortune, how should I spend it? What can be done here? Imagine someone you are tied to via social link and your relationship will deepen. If your bond has been damaged, you may be repaired. Time will pass as you ruin your fortune. Depending on your luck, your fortune may have an effect on your wallet, for better or for worse. For better? Also, heads up, by the way, as I think the kid of the shrine also gives you access to unlock a new link when you rank 2 or 3, I believe. The new link won't be accessible till later. I'm gonna do them all eventually. So it's all good in the hood. I just don't want to waste my time slots. Alright, little girl that's having trouble at home. 
Wait, you're the hang persona, and I don't have a hang persona. I don't want to be that asshole, but I don't have a hang persona. No one. Chubby student. Maiko wants to level up. And Bukichi and Mitsuki. Ah. Uh, I don't want to use time. How am I going with social links? They're rank 7! I could release one of my chariots. I could get rid of my chariot. Could get rid of my chariot. Or I could just get the old couple out of the way. Let's see what- yeah? Marvelous. Tower growing within me. What? How may I assist you? Requests? Here are my requests? Oh, now you've got more available! Holy crap, that came out of nowhere! Potent medicine. Oh, yes. Research lab called the Nurses, with learning facility. Experimental ranging scientific to supernatural. I conducted there all day and night for the sake of humanity. Apparently, aside from ordinary medicine, potentially lethal ones are also created. That said, I would like you to negotiate with the master of the nurse's office and bring me the potent medicine. By all means. So you want potassium? Old document I three. A report of success. Twenty persona I fusions. A report of success. Have a persona that is level twenty-three or By higher. All means. Show Elizabeth and Onimaru Kun Itsuna. By all means. Did I buy that? Bring an item that Elizabeth asks for. <laughs> Request, I'll be changing it up and issuing a little quiz. Bring me a triangular sword. Your hint, it was originally used for dueling. Triangular sword originally used for dueling. Triangular sword. Is this a riddle? If you need help figuring it out, perhaps you ought to try asking one of your close friends. Sometimes it is the most wise to ask others for assistance. I will await a report of success. Let me try to figure this out. Triangular sword originally used for dueling. Bring a fashionable oh, item. Yes. I've heard that all humans are greatly fixated on their appearance. Therefore, I'd like to try my hand at dressing up as well. If you don't mind terribly, could you please bring me a fashion item that would suit me? I believe you can find something in a place where people often gather to mingle. I'll be looking forward By to it. All means. Okay, so just buy something. Uh, I'd like to be gifted a bouquet of flowers. Well, this is getting serious. Most excellent. Oh, it seems now, you've already completed this request. I mean, I was gonna give it to someone else, but like, sure, why not? Oh, this is mine. This is the bouquet of roses you I asked for. Thanks. They're gorgeous. Thank you for this lovely gift. I've heard that in the language of flowers, the meaning of a bouquet depends on how many stalks there are. <laughs> so this bouquet means, <laughs> I'll look more into the matter later. It doesn't count if you ask for it. Female winter garb. Okay. Very well then. You can get the medicine at the shop around the corner from the velvet room. I figured as much. Since you bought the flowers from the shopping program. <sighs> Apparently people only use it for dares. But enough of that. Take your time and start browsing. Sale today. Buy whatever you need. It was the medicine, right? You made it. That's all you hey, You got everything you need. Come again, yeah? It was just this medicine, right? Good. Are you accepting a request? I want Jack Frost dolls. Bring Elizabeth not one Jack Frost doll, but three of them. Damn it! Come to think of it. I hear there are Jack Frost dolls in your world. I would like one. No correction. Three of those dolls, please. One for me to love, one to display, and one to promote his adorableness. By all means. Crap. What did you want again? Here are my requests. You wanted medicine? 
potent medicine. I can't get potent medicine. He didn't have potent medicine. Very well then. Also, the medicine is from the nurse's office. But you said around the corner from the velvet room. That was a dirty lie. Jack Frost, eh? That's where I got it, though. Come on, Jack Frost. Come on, I'm gonna be poor by the end of this, you heed to the hoe. 1,000?! Rain game, Jack Frost, plan till you win a prize. Alright, the average is not bad. Good day. Quests. Are you accepting a request? Let's Jack hear Frost. The result. Marvelous. Oh my, so soft. To be honest, I was conflicted over what sort of Jack Frost request to make. I also considered asking you to nurture him until he reaches level 99. But I'm glad I chose to make this request in the end since I've gotten such a cute doll out of it. That said, I would love to see Jack Frost at his strongest one day. Please take this as your reward. Just nurture him to level 99. Kill me now. Who is that guy that I could actually talk to? Gamer student. Let's see, to start the game, insert one coin. Controller's using two buttons and what are you looking at? I'm not reading the directions, I'm carefully planning my moves. So reading the instruction manual. Level 99 Jack Frost seems fun. He can be. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Persona! Registration. All have been registered. Which will you choose? So, Hiero, and that makes justice. Hiero, and that makes principality. Right, I need to summon back my principality. Take so, I'm gonna have to get rid of one of my chariots. To consider. I'm gonna have to get rid of one of my chariots. Are you finished? We look. I have way too many confidant social links active at one time. I legit just need to get one of my social links out of the way. Legit. It's getting to that point. Alright, old people, I'm gonna spend some time with you. I gotta get this crap out of the way. There's, there's too many people. I just gotta get the old couple out of the way. It needs to happen. Get those brownie points ready, guys. Alright, I've been away for like six months. You're finally here. We've been waiting for you. I wanted to tell you the good news as soon as possible. It's about a customer who came by earlier. Who do you think it was? Here's a hint. Signature. A celebrity. A petitioner? A fan of yours. I'm gonna say a fan of yours. That's right. How'd you guess? One of my fans came by. He said he'd bring the rest of the fan club next time. Yeah, I wish. Actually, it was one of the organizers of the campaign to save the persimmon tree. He said, let's protect the tree together. He's already gathered a number of signatures from students who are in our son's class. That's great. That's amazing. I think that's amazing is better. Everyone's banding together to honor the memory of our son. 
he really was loved by many. Of course. He was our proud son. I'm sure he's just as happy as we are. All right. Let's go to GeckoCon right now. I have to tell my son the good news. Your son's the tree? Sure, let's go. Right now? I guess, sure, let's go. That's my boy! <laughs> Music to my ears! These guys are really easy to please. <laughs> I've never been so excited to go for a walk before. The elderly couple is showing me their... Uh, yeah, the elderly couple is showing their affection for me. Good luck with growing closer. Let's race to the persimmon tree. I won't lose. Not even to a youngster like you. All right, dear. We'll be back. Thanks for watching the store. Wait, you're not bringing it with you? I visited the tree with Boon Kichi son and then returned to the dorm. Wait, so you're saying I need the old couple for days that school kids are not available. But you're thinking about this the wrong way. I can use that time. I can use that time to rank up my relationship with them at the shrine. Therefore not losing actual time. And I can free up a slot and get a bonus. Why wouldn't I do that? I think the time at the shrine costs the time slot though. It does. So does the old couple. They said that the MCM Bukichi had to hop the fence because the school was closed. That's awesome. Wait, he hopped the f what? The girls' rooms are so much better decorated than the guys. Her room also looks bigger than mine. I'm jealous. Yes. Come in. I think we should start heading to the command room and... Huh? You already finished unpacking? I was planning on helping you out later, too. Well, I didn't have too much with me, so... I finished a lot sooner than I expected. Oh, are you good with computers by any chance? No, she can't, like, fix your thing thing. You think you could teach me? I'm really not good with stuff like that. Sure, if you'd like me to. Are you looking into something? Yes. I figured I should know everyone's defining characteristics and whatnot to prepare for battle. I can't do any actual fighting, so I need to make myself useful. Yay, she's an analyst. Oh, I see. You're a really hard worker, Yamagishi-san. And you've got an amazing ability, too. Now that I think about it, everyone in this dorm is pretty amazing, huh? Even Junpei? Sonata-senpai is hands down one of the strongest. And our leader has a power unlike anyone else's. Mind Fura, please. Thank you. I bet Kirijo-senpai is strong, too. And Junpei... Well, he's... whatever. Ouch. Ouch. Poor Junpei. But what do I have? I'm only half the person everyone else here is. I couldn't even do anything the last full moon. Well, that thing you were fighting was weak to pierce attacks and you didn't manage to land a crit, so I don't know. Maybe I don't need to be here after all. <laughs> oh god. What, you feel like you're getting replaced just because the new girl joined? That's not true at all. Huh? I was told that a persona is the power of the soul, also known as your other self. But what happens if your persona is entirely useless? Does that mean that you're basically useless? That's why I think a person's personality and feelings are reflected in their persona. God, now I'm genuinely curious what my persona would look like. <laughs> For example, Takeba-san, your persona has healing powers, right? Mm hmm. That's because there's a kindness in you that no one else has. Uh, I'm not kind at all. 
I just don't want to see anyone go down or get hurt, that's all. Interesting. <laughs> Satan? That's one hell of a compliment. A bear with a mohawk? That actually sounds really cool. Oh my god, a bear with a mohawk! That's the Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood reference! Nice. Come on. I think Akutsuki sounds gonna be here soon. That man's a legend, by the way. Oh, and you can just call me Yukari. I hope you like it here, Fuka. I'm sure I will. Thank you, Yukari chan. Remember the boss shifted weaknesses? So probably Sorry wasn't weak to pins which you all fought again it. So soon, but I brought something special today. First name basis already? I know, adorable. Well, let me just show you before I get into explaining what it is. Let me guess, it's a new gun. like to provide you with some new equipment. Black and dark gray with red armbands. Yes. After spending quite some time in development, we're now ready for the battle testing phase. But I've just gotten new outfits from that lady. And now you've given me this. What do we wear? The shadows are getting stronger. You just barely won the last battle. I see what you did there with the bear pun. We can only assume they'll grow even more powerful still. That's why you all need something more to stay in the fight. You mean the chocolate from the pharmacy? From now on, I want everyone to use these during your operations. Combat gear, complete with a matching armband. And... Your new trump card in the battle against the shadows. Cartridges that enable the use of Theurgy. What the hell is a Theurgy? Trump card? Theurgy? Theurgy means spiritual magic that could reach the gods in Greek. So I can shoot the personas now? To put it simply, it synchronizes with the user's emotions. And when the right conditions are met, allows them to unleash an attack of immense power. Like channeling the dark side? Oh, you're talking about signature attacks. Oh yeah, I've been waiting for something like this. Okay, how does it work? Well, about that. It's a bit difficult to explain. I think it might be easier if you just try it out for yourselves. What he's saying is he doesn't know. You're asking a lot. Oh, please. If you can handle a persona, this should hardly be any more difficult. It's been thoroughly tested for safety, too. So nothing to worry about there. Tested on who? Oh, there's a manual for it as well. Take a look at it if you feel the need. No one ever reads those. Well, I'm sure glad I made it in today. With Yamagishi-kun joining us, Kirijo-kun can go back to being a frontline fighter. That means Seas is going to have a new lineup after today. Finally! Can we just go kill stuff now, please? And what better time than now to roll out this new weapon? Don't you agree? Oh, would you look at the time? I'd like to talk more about this, but I've been quite busy with the investigation into those large shadows. I think we're on the verge of a breakthrough, though, so I'll be sure to let you know what we find out soon. So, if I go into Tartarus with, say, for example, Yukari and Junpei, and their SP goes to zero, if I was to swap in Kirijo and Akihiko, will their SP be 100? So I'm basically refreshing my team just by swapping people in and out for the situation? Yes. Sweet. Okay, I'm leaving the rest to you, Kirijo-kun. Kun? That just sounds weird. Kirijo-kun. That just sounds weird. Kirijo-kun. Couldn't you say, like, Chan? Or Sama? Kirijo-kun? The hell? I sort of thought 
about this before, but he's rather laid back, isn't he? More like careless. It's fine. We should just give it a go, like the chairman said. In fact, since everyone's already here, now might be the best opportunity. Yay! I'm not gonna lose an evening just because I spent time in story time. Kirja, have I mentioned that I love you? Let's head into Tartarus and try out our new equipment. Ah! Oh! oh, you know the way to my heart. I've been wanting to get back into the swing of things anyway. And this will serve as a good test of our team lineup with Yamagishi as backup. It just, she just gets me. She just gets me. How does that sound? Oh, you have absolutely no idea. You have no idea. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't mind. Looking forward to this. Sounds like a pain. Shut up! Looking forward to this. Man, this trump card stuff is getting me so pumped up! I'm gonna be all like, take this, Super Ace Dune Pay Attack! Or something like that. I'm a little nervous since it's my first time, but I'll follow your lead. That's the spirit. All right, we'll go into Tartarus once everyone is geared up. Yay, I don't lose an evening. I actually get to go in. And I'm not going to lose an additional evening because it's part of the story itself. Oh, this is so good. Wait, this is the gear? I thought it was just like gray. Whoa, what happened to the FPS? Why is it so shit? What was it, five frames per second or something? I know, uniforms, they show solidarity. And damn, Akihiko, you're looking like Wesker there. I like it. Come on, could you at least wear it like you're supposed to? Someone get Akihiko a pair of sunglasses right now. It's the only thing that he's missing. Someone get that man a pair of sunglasses and some hair gel. Oh, but it does look like everyone's outfits are a bit different. I'd certainly hope so. Each one is made to complement our physiques and fighting styles. Physiques. <laughs> physiques. I love it. They were testing the prototype out on me. But it feels even better than it did before. It's very light and sturdy. I wonder if it's the same materials they use in the military. Or maybe even the ones for spacesuits. Yeah, it's probably Spectra. It's nice and you can weave it in between the fibers and it's also elastic enough. And if you expose it to sunlight, it's not going to fall apart like Kevlar does. Seems like this armband isn't just for decoration either. Nani? According to the manual, there are a bunch of different features built into it. For example, it can give you a readout of your vitals. Hmm... What else? There's also a function that notifies you when you can use your theurgy? I like how she's wearing the headset where she can hear people speaking because it has a microphone, but it's going to block out high-pitched and high-decibel sounds such as gunshots and whatnot. It's basically what you wear in helicopters or on a shooting range. How do you use it? Sorry, it doesn't look like there's much information about that. All I can tell is that you load the cartridge into your evoker to use it. Then let's make that our objective for today. Make sure to stay alert, everyone. All right, Yamagishi, you're going to be our backup, just like I mentioned before. 
This time, I'll be joining the rest of you in battle. Yeah, yeah. I'm going too. I gotta make sure my skills are still sharp. Me too. All right. Then including our leader, that will be our team. Uh Junpei kinda didn't get mentioned. Wait, I wanna go too! <laughs> I was so ready for this! You can't just put me on standby. That's just so cruel. Junpei's just sitting there. We can't go without our leader. You stay here and support Yamagishi. Oof. Hey, I thought you wanted to spend time with the new girl, Junpei. You're our last line of defense. Gotta keep our ace in reserve. Only you can do it, Junpei. <laughs> I'm gonna be nice. Oh, really? When you put it that way, how can I refuse? Don't worry, Fuka. Nothing's getting past me. Uh, okay. She sounds worried. There he goes again. Fuka, if it gets too dangerous, just leave him behind. And don't be afraid to smack him if he tries anything funny. <laughs> okay, got it. <laughs> huh? You get it? Yamagishi, could you scout the area and find a good floor for us to start on? Okay. Wait, so this is the second time she's using her persona and she's already adapted using it? What the hell? It seems different in here from before. Well, that's nothing new, right? No, not like that. It seems distorted. It's probably just temporary. Distorted how? I'll try and find a stable floor for us to start on. Let me guess, this is going to be the same floor that I was on. You can tell that much already? Wow, Fuka. Now imagine when she gets a hang of this thing. It could be because we didn't enter the usual way last time. Or because of those huge shadows. We have no idea what's going to happen in here. Not that I'm complaining, though. All right, let's go. Oh, that new sword looks pretty cool. I got a new what now? And this bow I got is really light and looks pretty easy to use. I can't wait to see it in action. Wait, did we all just get new weapons for free? So the chairman got us all new weapons too, huh? Guess we should be thanking him. So what, I throw away all my old weapons? He barely explained anything though. Sometimes I can't tell if he's actually helpful or not. He gave us free all weapons. This has been custom made for us. You can tell because of the C's mark engraved on everything. Yeah, but that's not giving you a tactical advantage. As always, you're in command. And make sure to check the equipment before we get started. Yeah, 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 check the equipment. C's sword, C's longbow, C's greatsword, C knuckles. Right. Alright, new outfits. Yeah! It's all you, dude. I'll hold things down here, so give him hell. Hmm. Therogy, was it? Look forward to seeing how it works. That aside, let's handle this like we always do. It's Masuru's first real battle in a while, too. <laughs> I can finally fight at your side now. On top of that, we have new battle gear and equipment. Hopefully you'll find me reliable. Hmm. Oh, by the way, do you know what those numbers on our new armbands mean? If it's the order that we join C's, shouldn't yours and mine be reversed? Maybe it's kind of random. I mean, there's no number two. Sorry, what? Everyone's got the what now? What's everyone's number? Sorry, what? 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 I can't see them, can I? Nope. Oh God damn it! You can't do that to me. Who's what number? I just got blue ball. Fun fact, in the movie, Fuka's 
persona actually protects her when she's inside it. It's not the best in terms of protection, but it's enough to protect her long enough for others to save her. You can look if you look really hard at their outfits. No one can see that shit. I'm gonna do it in break time. Speaking of break time, let's take a quick little break and then jump in. Uh, on the stat page, it's on the right side in the white part. Stat page, eh? Nope. I don't... Uh, I don't actually see it. I don't actually see it. Now we've got a lot of slashes here. Yeah, no, I didn't see the number. Oh, on the left side. I thought that was just literally in whatever order the party is. Akihiko is one. Right, Mitsuru is zero. She's six. We're three. She's four. Five. I think it's the order in which people activated their persona because Yukari couldn't pull the trigger. That's why Yukari's four and we're three, because we activated our persona before she did. We have no two. Because they're not here now. It could be the chairman or it could be someone else. It could be like Mr. Longhead Dude with the red cape. Yeah. Probably. Alright, I'm gonna take a quick break and then we're gonna jump into Tartarus. 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 Not Tartarus. 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 Alright, quick little break and then we go to Tartarus. Tartarus. What a good song. Alright, let's kick it off. I just want to do some combat. I mean, everyone's talking about weapons, and I still got a long wazakishi. Alright, this is an upgrade. A sharp one-handed sword designed for fighting shadows. No stab bonus, but it gives me extra damage. All-purpose apron, still good. Blaze earrings, still good. Seize uniform. Combat attire made for operation activities. I mean... What does the winter uniform look like? Oh, the winter uniform is literally just my school outfit. Okay. Then I will wear... Oh, uniform and armband. Then I'll just wear the C's uniform. And we've got Yukari's toy bow. Uh, this is a really minor upgrade. It's an accuracy upgrade. But rage high. Shoot suction cup. If it hits, it leaves the suction cup. Plus rage high. Maybe it increases the probability of rage or just increases its effect. But accuracy, good. Wait, so she's got C's uniform and then she's got winter uniform. And winter garb, casual wear. Oh, that's just... That's just... Wait, what? Oh, it's literally just what she wears outside. No, wait, it's different. No, 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 it's a winter outdoor stuff. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to be something special. It's not, it's just her casual outfits. Yeah, whatever. It's fine. Junpei sees great sword accuracy down. So crit rate up, and this is just normal. See, I would take the one with slightly fewer points of damage but higher accuracy. A sword favored by a monk who saved the country for Junpei. I would actually continue using this. It's I'd say better than this actually because of the accuracy. Sees uniform, Akihiko brass gloves, sees gloves. Sure. Rapier, a sharp rapier designed for fighting shadows. But this is more of a stabbing implement rather than a slashing one. But anyway. Alright, works for me. 
Alright, uh, Personas, Valkyrie, all this fun stuff. We should technically... Oh yeah, we've got Principality, that's fine. Um... Let's see how we go. I just want to make sure the personas are saved. If they're saved, we're good to go. And we can sacrifice personas if we need to. Tobo has less accuracy, but a normal attacks have a high chance of inflicting rage. More Twilight Fragments. How may I assist you? Alright, let's save this. If I start seeing he hoes, I might just get my he ho out. Very well. We look but then again, we might actually have Valkyries as well, we don't know. We'll have to see what the new area gives us. Either way, let's just get in there. What'd you find? Um. I'll be here to provide backup. When I'm all geared up like this, everyone else it gets me really psyched up. Yes. Sure. Try to guide you to a more stable floor. I can't go with you, but I'll do my best to hang on from here. What floor can we do? Yeah. Looks like we're here. Yamagishi, do you copy? Yes, I'm here. Ha, huh, take that out of contact. If I see he hoes, I'm gonna get my he ho out. Are you picking up any shadows? Um it looks like there's one close by. Be careful. Alright, let's head over there and feel things out. What floor are we on? <laughs> it's been a while since I felt this kind of tension. <clears throat> Think you can keep up after all this time? Honestly. Believe me, I had no intention of falling behind. <clears throat> You're approaching a shadow. Get ready for battle. Damn, that's a big ass longbow. Badger that. I'm always ready. Leader, are you ready? Call me mine Fura. Then let's go. I'm still setting up. It'll take a little more time. Wait, I fought this thing before. This should be a good test of your strength. But don't get careless. The strong one. Be on your guard. I'll hit them where it hurts. Oh, you're ice. Ha! <laughs> you're the ice queen! Wait. Ice. Repair. Oh, god damn it, Esdeath. Shocking. Oh, it drains your SP. I swear I've taken this thing out before. Yeah, I've taken this thing out before. See, my memory's not that bad. See, I'll remember your weakness, but I won't remember your name. And they may look similar, but their affinities change depending on mask and whatnot. Fair enough. Looks like everything went well. Wait, I didn't get shuffle time even though I finished it. Fuka, you were amazing! Great job! Thank you, Yukari chan. So they were all supposed to be weak to um. Mitsuru. I still send some enemies nearby. The other one you had had an electric weakness, not an ice. Oh. Oh, we're engaging them, all right. All right, the tutorial fight is done. Snuff sounds a little bit suspect. Yes, we see it. So thunder and ice. 
It's the heat of the hose taking over. This guy's just a fire heat hose. Yeah, I do think each companion do have a unique scene with summoning their persona for the first time, and I think you just spent it. Such a ripoff. Oh, hello. So I lost my unique scene because I didn't use her persona. I think whoever decided that deserves to be shot. I'm just saying. Part of that is your fault. Not exactly. They should just have that trigger the first time the persona actually gets summoned. It's kind of, how should I say, Presumptuous to think that everyone is going to summon the persona. Yes. I mean, I think it would be a lot of people's first instinct to see what personas they have. That is a dangerous assumption. Yes. I'm far more in my element here. Let me show you that I haven't lost my touch. Let's go. Yes. The enemy down. That was amazing. Here we come. Crushing victory. Yeah, whoever decided to make this skippable is a bit of a dud. Looks like everything went well. Buka, you were amazing. They should. They should literally just make it trigger the first time you actually use her persona. Thank you, Yukari chan. It makes more sense that way. I still send some enemies nearby. Keep an eye out if you decide to engage them. Oh, we're engaging them, alright. It's not even that hard to program. You could have just done a next fight. But we don't know. You guys were saying that it gets skipped. Are you saying that, um, because I, I don't think I actually used Akihiko's persona. Time to take you see, that's going to be one hell of a test, because I never actually used Akihiko's. Whoever said that has clearly not played the game. So basically, people that haven't played the game are telling me what the game does, even though they don't know. What? So Akihiko is our Pikachu, so we'll do this and try Akihiko. Let's see if it works. Let's test that theory. Let's test it. I'm gonna waste a little bit of his SP. Yeah, no. You don't get the unique. So I never got to see Akihiko's. I didn't even know that was a thing. I didn't even know that was a thing. Because I instinctually don't waste SP. So basically the guys that program Persona just assume. Wow. Bravo. I minus a point from this game. That's really bad. Seems to be working out. What about that Toji thing? Yamagishi, have you figured out your end? Um, I'm sorry, it's still unclear. I am picking something up during battle though. I see. There's no pressure, just continue your observation. Oh, hello. That wasn't your first use of his persona. Let's do this. I did use a strike, but I don't think I actually saw it. Yeah, he got skipped since he wasn't there since you decided to grind to Tartarus before he came to available to your group. Wait, so because I did Tartarus before he joined, I don't actually get to see his opening 
even though I used his persona in the first fight. Okay, this game can't get a 10 out of 10 because it has oversights. The maximum score it can get is 9 out of 10. That is just stupid. They just assume that someone would check the character's persona and they're usually right. The game's programmer is an idiot. I'm just putting it out there. They didn't think that someone would actually do Tartarus without Akihiko. That is stupid. That is stupid. That is ridiculous. They thought someone wouldn't do Tartarus. That is stupid. They think someone would actually ignore the gameplay of the game. No, that is stupid. I mean, most people would want to see the shiny new toy right away. And that shiny new toy is Tartarus. Why is that stupid? He told you he was almost recovered and you ignored him. No, that's not what I mean. The point is, they didn't think that someone would actually go into Tartarus and clear it. That's stupid. You need to summon them on the first time available and not on the full moon segment. I know, but that's stupid. Because that assumes that you're gonna go straight to Tartarus after they become available. Which is a stupid assumption. Someone optimizing time might not want to do that. Someone might be low on currency and need money. Or someone might be bored and just wants to go to Tartarus. Like, it's a stupid assumption. It's silly. And you miss core gameplay. It's, it's just... It's it's pretty bad. It's a pretty bad oversight. Let's take these guys down. Pretty bad. That's just your assumption. You're not exactly being optimal here yourself. How is that an assumption? It's a fact. <laughs> it's an objectified fact. It's, my turn. <laughs> it's not available because I didn't go to Tartarus during that segment. And the reason I didn't go is because I already cleared it. So they basically assumed someone wouldn't go to Tartarus and clean it. Because now Akihiko is under level. But that doesn't matter. <laughs> it's still an oversight on the game developer. It's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. Hey, at least she does a crap ton of damage. But still, a little disappointing. Oh well. Yes, yeah, since you would want to wait a bit, since the game didn't repeatedly tell you Aki would be able to join soon, and you instantly did it before Aki was ready. But again, they let me do it. Why would you do that, though? You ignore the game's warnings, you have to take some blame. I don't have to take any blame. They could have easily programmed it into the game that the first time he does combat, he shows his persona off. But it doesn't. So it's an oversight. Yeah, and it wasn't a warning. It was just basically saying that Akihiko would be ready. That's not a warning. But anyway. Doesn't matter. The game gets a maximum of 9 out of 10. Because it has oversights. So if I kill the enemy and the other two are down, it doesn't actually count as a... Um, what's it called? Shuffle time. Oh well. Sometimes it's better to wait a little before going to Tartarus. So basically you have to play the game the way the programmers programmed it. Otherwise you miss out on things because they weren't intuitive enough to actually do programming. That's just lazy. That's just really lazy. Imagine getting punished to play the game. That's pretty bad. I no longer detect any shadows. All the ones on this floor have been defeated. You did Tartarus. We're gonna punish you for that. Okay. It's all coming back to me. Okay. It would be wise for me to keep battling. Let's keep going then. Let's I mean, that's how it game. happens. You get rusty, and then you just start getting it back. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. We missed something. We missed the room, actually. Okay, we didn't really miss much. 
also the game, first one in the Fountain of Modern Persona. So take this game with a grain of salt, even with a remake. But isn't a remake your opportunity to mix past mistakes? Sorry, fix past mistakes. So why wouldn't you use that opportunity? Unless you didn't realize something was a mistake. Ah. So it's clearly an oversight. We originally got no awakening scenes. I get that, but the point is that they completely had an oversight. They only considered one option. They never considered that people might play the game. You know what I mean? Hang on. Let me guess, powerful shadow. Sounds good to me. Is it some kind of powerful shadow? No, it's... It feels similar to the distortion I felt earlier. Roger. Don't be another block. Let's move carefully and assess the situation when we get upstairs. Please don't be another block. Huh? What happened? What? Why is it all dark? Where did everyone go? Yay, we're separated. Please, everybody, just stay calm. It looks like you were all sent to different locations on this floor. Well, this is interesting. So they separated us by force. I like it. There's danger lurking in this darkness. Kuma doesn't have patience for fighting, so you're partly to blame here too, even if you don't want to accept it. Wait, so... Because I like playing the battle component of the game, I should be punished for that in a game about battling personas. Bad Kuma. You definitely shouldn't enjoy the combat element of the game and wanting to blitz it in one night. Very bad Kuma. Enjoying the game too much. We need to regroup as soon as possible. Yamagishi, can you guide us? Blame the player about a lack of programming because you ignored the game warning and just refusing to accept that it was your decision. But it wasn't a warning. They literally said he'll be available in a few days. It didn't say you should wait a few days. It's legit just like he'll be available in a few days. It's just lazy programming. It's just lazy. It's like it's something that could be polished. It's just, I mean, that's just simply commentary. It's something that they could have fixed, that they didn't fix. It is what it is. What can you do? Some programmers are just lazy. Uh, why now? Fuka, where should I go if I want to? <gasps> Incoming. Yukari-chan, look out! No. <laughs> Later, you're here. Well, that was quick. Did I just get <gasps> Did I just get shot with cannons? If I everyone's always protecting me. I'm getting hurt because of it. If I get a game over now, I'm gonna be pissed. What am I even doing? Is her persona gonna evolve? Fuka, I need you to back me up. I'll hold this thing off until everyone else gets here. Why'd you heal yourself? That's a magazine. 
When emotions run high in battle, you or your party members will be able to activate Teruji. Teruji can be activated on your turn when your Teruji gauge is at max. Unlike normal skills, they do not cost HP or SP. Press R2 to activate your Therogy. Please note that it cannot be used while you are inflicted by status ailment. Okay. Deal severe wind damage to one foe, ignoring resistances. I like that! After healing someone, her desire to prevent death strengthens. Really? So if I use you as a healer, you will actually get a damage boost. So you get rewarded for using her as a healer. Interesting. Are you okay? Interesting. I'm sorry. It was all my fault. Good to see you're okay. What was that just now? I don't really know. My body just sort of took control. Ah, slav mode. Takeba, later. Looks like you both are okay. Sorry I worried everyone. It's all right. You did well in handling an unexpected situation. Hmm. So what was that called again? Eh, we'll find out later. Maybe we should consider starting over. Let's head back to the entrance for now. No! Good work out there, team. No! I don't want to go home. I'm sorry. I should have been able to navigate better. At least the Therogy scene was mandatory to see. Because it was scripted. No free Tartarus run. Those bastards. You did great for your first time. I don't want to leave. I'm kicking and screaming right now, you cowards. I agree. I'm convinced that you're the one we need on support. Yeah, thanks a lot, Fuka. I didn't do anything. It was all you, Yukari-chan. You really thought they wouldn't make you spend time. Those bastards! This is worse than simply not letting me go to Tartarus. This is letting me go to Tartarus and then dragging me out, kicking and screaming after I've had a taste of it, you bastards. That special attack sure was cool though, Yukatan. How'd you do it? How'd you see it? How? I just focused really hard and thought to myself, I have to do whatever it takes. And while I was thinking that, I kind of felt something surging inside me. Like the Slipknot song? The chairman did say the cartridge would synchronize with our emotions. Right. Although, I'm still not entirely sure how it works. Weaponized healing. From what I could tell, it reacted to Yukari-chan's strong emotions. So this weapon gives the user strength beyond their limits when their emotions are heightened? Like Super Saiyan? Uh, I don't really get it. But basically, if we're fired up enough, we can really pop off, right? And thanks to you, Yukari-chan, we have a good idea of how it works. From now on, I should be able to tell when someone can use theirs. I'm dying to try for myself. It's all thanks to you, Kari. I'm just gonna be nice. I, I didn't do much. I just got lucky. I don't know much more than anyone else. I'll do more research into how the sinking with emotions works later. Everyone has different feelings when they're fighting. So, the timing on when they can use these will probably be different, too. I'd like to give it a go myself, but we should call it a day for now. Oh. We can't overwork our leader, and we've got some time until the next full moon. I'm totally fine. Come on, let's continue. I'm a little worried about the change with the floors, though. What if something like that happens again? It's gonna happen every single time. Yes. If something has changed in the tower, we'll need to be extra careful when exploring from now on. In any case, we may have had some problems, but we learned a lot today. 
Not only did we get to test our new lineup and equipment, but we also got to see that we're all improving at a remarkable pace. Aw, Kirijo senpai Quit buttering me up. But you weren't even up there. You were literally sitting down on the ground floor. It includes everyone except you. Just leave everything to Junpei Iori, the soon-to-be MVP. Maybe I shouldn't be the one to say this, but... Oh god, she's gonna say it. You literally didn't do anything today. Ooh. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Critical damage. <laughs> Emotional damage. I really need to get that on the soundboard. Oh yeah, I've got a online girlfriend. Hello, this is Elizabeth speaking. Oh god, not again. I'm calling in regard to a recent change in Tartarus. Sorry, what? It seems that a path that had been blocked off is now open. Hell yeah. I thought it prudent to inform you. Thank you. Well then, I wish you a safe journey. The fact that my battery is not on 100% gives me anxiety. Elizabeth said that a previously blocked path is now open. I should check it out next time I go to Tartarus. Well. Uh, what now? I got a text message. A little refresher. What are you up to today? If you're free, let's go somewhere. Let me know if you can make it before afternoon. Bruh, I got a, like... Girlfriend on the PC that just so happens to probably be a teacher at our school. There's no school today. It's almost time for the home shopping channel. And I'm gonna buy more crap. It's Mitsuko. I'm getting better at sending messages. It's because I practice with you. Bunkichi is feeling much better now. Thank you for everything. Come visit soon. Your message from Maya. Hey oh friendo! Time to go monster hunting. Alright, time for the shopping channel. I hope I have enough money. How much money do I have? 6,000. That should be enough. Right? It's amazing! Uh-huh. Father's Day gift campaign. How better to show your father how much you appreciated him with a heartfelt gift. First up, we have a brand watch. Your father won't be able to contain himself. Not bad. Kid. Mega protein. All for 4,000. Fine. Thanks. All right, let's instant transmission and pick up the um, duplication. Hmm? Oh. Hello, Kuma. Hey. I've been chatting with Amada-kun today, and boy, he really is mature, you know? No, Yukari! Bad Yukari! That is cradle snatching! Bad girl! He definitely acts a lot more adult than Junpei. Oof! He's standing right there! Jeez, Yukatan, that's mean. How about you? You think I'm totally the more mature one, right? I'm not as more mature. What? You two? Come on, man. That's messed up, ganging up on me like that. Ah, <sighs> poor guy. Cool. Also, don't forget to talk to your allies in dorm, since I think they have some connection to Liz's request. I mean, she did say they will give me a hint about the sword. That's a triangle. That used to be used as a dueling sword. I've got two of each, huh? Yeah, there is a little bit of backseating going on, I agree. Alright, um, let's not do this, it's fine. I mean, the SP drinks did come out. This one doesn't actually have anything. This one should have an SP drink. And since we're going to Tartarus, I should grab the SP drinks. 
What the heck? Lazy student, I'm lazy these days. I think I've got apathy syndrome. Get better soon. Hey, I was just kidding. Skilled reporter. I heard there's a growing movement on the internet these days. I don't know what it's called, but this one guy is gathering lots of users around him. I'm not sure what he's up to or why. He's not just being overhyped. This guy definitely knows what he's doing. Maybe I should check up on him sometime. Okay. I mean, the more social links I do, the more boost I get in Tartarus when I um, combine things. But to be fair, next month I'm going to have even more. So I don't know if it's like worth delaying. Triangle that used to be used. Cat loving boy. I asked my friend if his cat was really expensive. You know what? He said it was free. He said his mum got it from an animal shelter. I don't know how you could do that. I thought you could only get cats from pet stores. Unfortunately, the pet stores in Japan are actually affiliated with the Yakuza. And they have puppy and cat farms. It's really unethical. It's really, really bad. Oh yeah, Maya. Totally forgot about that. Alright. We got our hermit. Oh yeah, we almost knocked Meyer out of the ballpark. Why does Maul have a thing? Um, because... There's Boonkichi. You know what? I am close to getting Hyro to 10, and Maya is almost 10 as well. And as soon as those are done, I don't need the Hermit or the Hierophant persona in my inventory. So I can get rid of this guy that I barely ever use, and then I can get rid of Hermit as well, which I kind of barely use. I mean, don't get me wrong, utility, but I barely use it. Hmm. An enemy that only appears on a full moon. Maybe I should reorganize uh, re my training regimen while I still have time. <laughs> I thought that we were supposed to stay in the dorm on our days off. Or rather, I used to think so. Yukari-chan mentioned earlier that she was going to visit the shrine. So we have more freedom here than I expected. It's a new experience for me. What kind of household did you bloody grow up in? Poor thing. Oh, a quest. I'm going to save just in case she gets mad at me. What is it? I have to think of it. Elizabeth asked me to get a specific item for her. You're looking for a triangular sword? Is that supposed to be a riddle? I'm not sure what you mean. Hmm, a triangular object used for dueling. By any chance, are they talking about a fencing epair? It's not a triangular sword, no, but the cross section does resemble a triangle. Let me retrieve mine for you. You've got blades in your room? You know, the more I get to know you, the more I like you. Here you are, do you plan on taking up fencing? If so, I can teach you a thing or two, once I have some spare time. Dang. A slender sword with a triangular cross-section that is hard to bend. In that case... Hmm, Mr. Echo does punishment? Well, there are some things in life you don't want to know about. This is one of them. No, 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 no. I want to know. I want to know in graphic detail. Do you by chance have a recording? I would love to watch that on the HD monitor we have upstairs. By the way, how are my tomatoes doing? Sweet. I don't think the next floor's vending machine has SP. No, it doesn't. Alright, tomatoes. Whoops, wrong room. No new recordings. Then I want nothing to do with this thing. I think my tomato should be right. 16th. Ah, I'm two days too early. All 
All right, station real quick. My teacher told me it's been a lot of kidnapping these days, but he already said that yesterday and the day before that too. Kidnappings? That's not good. The fact that this map has two separate malls is annoying. Tell me about it. How am I doing for money? Yeah, I am dangerously low. That's the problem. I can't actually do much without money. Like, if I wanted to spend a week doing way. social stuff, I can't because I don't have the money to do it. The, those girls from your school who had apathy syndrome seem to have regained their senses. I'm guessing you all had a hand in that too. Now then, is there anything you need? Can I sell junk? Wanna... Sure. Yeah, this is not enough. I need to actually go to Tartarus. Are you sure that girl was not mentioning kidnapping? Uh, I don't know. She does fencing, has ice, and are we sure this isn't as death in another life? Hmm? You finished? Could be. I mean, basically, she's Sire 2.0. Be seeing ya. All right, let's spend time with our online girlfriend that's probably a teacher in our school, in ethics class, that is in love with us. That is awkward. What is Kirija Senpai gonna say about this? Did I just call a Senpai? What the f What the literal f All right, whatever, let's get groomed. Chat is blinking, Maya wants to play Sin Art Online, I think we can grow closer, I might grow closer, should I spend time? Let's do it, I think I'll spend the day playing games. What do you think Kirijo is going to be more upset about? The fact that we're spending all day playing video games, or the fact that we're getting groomed by our homeroom teacher? Important announcement. It has been our hope since the launch of Innocent Sin Online to maintain the game for as long as we are able. Unfortunately, after careful consideration, we have made the difficult decision to terminate service. We deeply apologize for any inconvenience this may cause for our loyal players. The servers will remain open until the official end date. Please tie up any unfinished business before that. Thank you for understanding. We hope you've enjoyed your time with Innocent Sin Online. Oh, you either move to another game or you dox yourselves. Sincerely, Innocent Sin Online stuff. The game's booted up now. I'm in Shinagawa Dungeon. I see Maya. You got that message from the admins, right, Tatsuya? Maya faces away. It said they're cancelling Innocent Sin. Think it's for real? Not much we can do. No way. Whatever, I guess. I think no way. Okay, cool, too. Thank you. I know, right? How dare they? Maya's getting all worked up. I finally found a place to vent my frustration and now this. Maya gets closer. Tatsuya, do you think we'll still be able to see each other? I think so. No, this is the end. Don't worry about that. <laughs> I think it's I think so. <laughs> no, this is the end. Any of them? Makes sense. I think so. I don't know how you can get to this stage of the thing by being an asshole. Yeah, I guess we gotta find another way. A different MMO maybe? Or IRL somewhere? I don't know. I like this one though. Maya seems a little down. No, we have to stop wasting our time. Maya's not going quietly. I'll beat them to the punch. What are you planning? This won't change anything. I'm gonna ask, what are you planning? Oh, don't worry, Tatsu. I won't do anything dangerous. She's gonna send in a bomb threat, isn't she? I'm gonna send them a log for the combos we've been having together here. If they know this game is important to us, maybe they'll reconsider. For two players, what? Even though you might be a middle-aged man or a 12-year-old girl. Oh my god, she knows what the internet is like. That shouldn't matter. To tell you the truth, I kinda hope you're a handsome guy though. 
Don't worry, Maya will protect you. We'll always be partners, okay? I can tell Maya cares about me. I think we're getting closer. I think Maya doesn't have many friends, so she's getting emotionally clingy to the only person she talks to. Which just so happens to be us. And then she's stalking her... student. Okay, I'm gonna go write my email with our combo log. So you're basically gonna share our private logs with the developers. Don't mess with Maya and friends or you'll regret it. Mwahahaha. <laughs> Next time we'll celebrate our victory. Okay, bye. Maya's player signed off. I decided to log off as well. Well, this just happened. Um. Once again, I will be substituting for Kiruja Senpai as your navigator from now on. Please let me know if you want to go to Tartarus. I'll do my best. That is so formal and adorable. Absolutely adorable. So, Dude, I almost got in trouble with the police today. I was damn lucky it was just a false alarm. What happened? What happened? You can't leave me hanging after telling me that! What the hell happened, man? I guess all that talk about Fuka being sick wasn't true. At first people were saying that she was absent because she was being bullied. But then they started saying she was really sick. Strange, huh? She seems pretty healthy to me. She was locked in a gym! She almost died. Let me think. I'm sure you're already feeling it, but the enemies are steadily growing more powerful. Don't be satisfied with how you are now. Work on improving your strength. If you wait until a, after a tough battle, it'll be too late. Tell me about it. That reminds me. Yamagishi-kun is surprisingly skilled with technology, and she's very kind, always considering others' feelings. Her name suits her perfectly. Fu means wind, and Ka means flower. Oh! Like a flower, gently blowing in. Ahem, <clears throat> getting off track here. But doesn't it depend on the kanji that you use? Because you can write the same thing with different kanji, which has different meanings. Right. Alright, let's just take a quick little break and go to Tartarus and slaughter a crap ton of things because I really need to do Tartarus. I am poor. I am absolutely broke. I'm pretty sure I can't even afford to get personas. Should we check in with Liz? I mean, we can talk to her at the bloody Tartarus. Marvelous. I can sense that the power growing within you, blah 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 blah. I have more of this Twilight Fragment. I'm looking forward to it. Indeed. What about your quest? Here are my requests. Report, bring this item back, and defeat 450 shadows. Wait, I defeated 450 shadows. Wonderful. Kami Musubi water. Let's hear this the one. results. Bingo, that is indeed what I requested. A fencing epair. If I may say so. As mentioned before, an epair was used to duel in ancient times. Fences should wear white uniforms so that the blood from the struck blows would be more visible. I have a request. And now, a special quiz for you. Do you know why my clothes are blue? Um, Because it suits you. Because it's soothing. No reason in particular. I would say because it suits you, because flattery would get you everywhere, but that's probably not the reason considering the last Velvet Room also had blue. So it's probably technically because it's soothing. But I would personally say because it suits you. Because I'm that type of guy. I'm gonna run with it. <laughs> I will ask my master for the correct answer. Please take this as your reward. Galleon sneakers. Sweet. Alright, 600 shadows. Easy. Bring the item Elizabeth is asking for. This time I'd like you to bring me some protein. Not just any protein, I'd like the one that even amateurs would be able to consume. Would you try looking for something like that, if such a thing even exists, of I will await a report of success. You want protein. I'll bring you a steak. Very well, then. Can I even afford anything? <sighs> Medicine, powder, muscle drink. I don't know if this counts as protein, though. In battle, restores 150 HP to one ally. 
I don't know if that counts as it though. It's been real humid recently. Better check your food for mold, lad. Don't want to get sick now. Look, <laughs> yeah, do not eat mold really bad. Also, can we raid Nico Beer tonight? I mean, if you request it and you redeem the coupons. I mean, muscle drink is typically protein powder, but like, I don't know. Done already? Uh, I'll buy one just in case. That's all you Done already? Come again. Yeah? If it's this one, it's this one. If not, I have an item that I can use later. Good day. Here are my requests. Nope, it's not it. All right, who do we know that's good with protein? Well. Let me guess. Oh, would you look at that? This guy knows about bodybuilding. Mm -hmm. Come to think of it, Elizabeth asked me to get a specific item for her. You want some protein? Gotta start bodybuilding, eh? Mm -hmm. Hey, I'm proud of you. I can give you something meant for beginners. Amateur protein. Yeah. It's called amateur protein. It's specially formulated for people like you. Bingo. You can recheck the request and check them for hints. I get hints. Good day. Requests. Are you accepting a request? Let's protein powder. This must be the brand of protein specially designed for amateur athletes. Amateur protein. How can it be for both amateurs and pros? Is that true? Uh, the word protein doesn't have anything to do with professionals. How very interesting. Thank you very much. I'm sure this must be quite valuable. So you can have a back. Please take your reward. Spiked bat. Is it spiked with nails? Is that it? Are you accepting a request? That's it. Very well then. That's it for now. But will you have enough if you're planning to go to Tartarus? But enemies in Tartarus give me money. We go to Tartarus to get money. Tartarus doesn't have money, then where do we money? How do we money? What is money? Get a job. No! <laughs> no, I'm gonna beat homeless people at school for money instead. Schedules. Alright, what's everyone's status? Seems everyone can go tonight. Hell yeah. I should reach out to those who can go tonight. But everyone can go tonight. Don't forget the fortune teller. SHIT! <laughs> Thank you for that. Please tell me I saved the game. My card is reacting. Major arcanas have been added to shuffle time. Empress N Ag Lu personas in your possession will be increased by two. Empress Stat Mart will be increased by two. I'm gonna save it just in case that doesn't trigger before. But I'm also gonna load and try to get the bonus. Wait, but I don't have the. Crap. That's why I said you have enough. Alright. Let's go to the club. We might have to do unsavory things for money. You need something. By the way, I got a designer pair of glasses in stock. Not only are they hip, they even work with the more feminine style. Well, if you can spare 1500 that is. Although, if you bring me a black quartz, I may be able to adjust the price. It's an extremely rare collector's item, you see. Anyway, it's up to you how much you're willing to give up for these glasses. Black quartz. I wonder if it's some kind of gemstone. To think of it, the shadows in Tartarus drop rare gems. Elizabeth might know something about it. Go and have a look. Browse products. Cool. Go have a look. Cool. Please tell me I have money. Change within you. We're now able to select a new fortune, gamble fortune. We're now able to select a new fortune, soul fortune. Now tell me, what shall it be? Would you like your fortune told? Um, I want to know my fortune. What kind of fortune do you seek? Increase the chances of encountering rare enemies. Increase chances of enemies turning into stronger rare enemies. Increase the rate at which gauges charge. 
Are you kidding me? One sec. Is that true? Sun and Amanda, some people in your world seek materials. Black quartz can be found in the second block of Tartarus. I heard that the lustful snake that appears in the latter half of the block is quite fond of collecting <laughs> them. A material that captivates both shadows and humans. Cool. So I basically got to take out the Are snake girl in the request? second block. I believe I am either Very in the well. second block or the third block now. So we should be fine. I'm going to sell some crap we don't need. Good to see you. I would like to sell got? my soul. I never felt like Sure Need it. Sure, it's a deal. How many? Need it. Sure. It's a deal. Not needed. All right, I'll take that. Not needed. How many? Sure. All right, I'll take that. A bat with nails driven into it release your inner bad boy. Damn! It's pretty hardcore. All done here. Come back soon. It's pretty hardcore. Equip, Kuma. Um. Oh, wait! I can't use the bat. Then it must be Junpei's bat. Juzu Maru. Yeah, the bat. Oh right, but its accuracy is lower. That's ugh. That ten percent is a lot. But fear. Nah, that's a difficult decision. Depending on hit rate. All right. Let's buy a fortune. I'd like to know my fortune. Rare enemies. Let's begin. Let's see it. Can you get new boots too? Probably. All right. Now we can go to the dorm. But let's hope the personas get a boost too. Cool. Come on, everyone gets a boost. I think it's tied to the date. Yep. Multiple major arcanas have been added to shuffle time. Empress. And Emperor. So they're gonna get stat up. I don't actually have an Empress. I have an Emperor, so Oberon's gonna have a good day. But I don't have an Empress. Kill! Cool. Alright, quick little break and let's do this. I'm gonna grab a quick coffee and then we're gonna push through Tartarus. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Quick break. You know, it's absolutely bloody rare that I like all the music from a particular game, anime, or anything. But bloody Vinland Saga just, just hit it out of the ballpark. All the openings and closings are bloody solid. They're bloody solid. The Emperor Empress thing was a uh, new cards for shuffle time. You got... Like the one that boosts XP for the duration of the Tatar uh, Tartarus visit. I also thought that since you get more of those cards, more units that come from those cards will spawn. Meaning that I'm going to get a lot of Emperors and a lot of Empress Personas that I can adopt. So it's an opportunity to stockpile on them. So I better get ready to save because they're about to level up. Also keep in mind that whoever you bench doesn't get XP. Yeah, I know. It's okay. It's okay. You can sit back and enjoy. I, if, if I get stuck, I'll ask for it. If I need help, I'll ask for it. Jack Brothers. Deals medium or minor damage to all foes. High chance of inflicting down. After summoning a persona, power within gradually enhances. 
Fusion spell is a special Thurgy unique to Puma that comes from fusing certain personas. Fusion spells can be acquired by registering certain personas in the compendium. Once these conditions are met, Elizabeth will inform you of a new fusion spell you can use inside the Velvet Room. Sweet. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Fuse. Registering, I see. Register all. Is overriding, except I've completed registration. Cool. Ah, please choose the personas you would like to fuse. Echo Shogun Cute. Seeing what personas come to be is a great joy of mine. Yeah, I'm just gonna go in with these ones. They're registered, so I can just throw away weak personas. Quick little equipment check. Resist fear. Nullify poison. Guess that works. What you currently wearing? Ice evasion low. But you're not fire. Nullifies poison. Held sandals. Rubber Soul Junpei. Wait, he doesn't have shoes? What the hell? Inverse shoes. He doesn't have... Oh my god. High... Uh, Knee-high boots. Frost heels. But you are ice, so you're fine. Black loafers. But you're not in combat, are you? Okay. Okay. Quick weapons check. Blaze earrings, reduce fire damage low. I'm not using Heho, so I don't need to worry about fire. Reduce strike damage, pierce damage, fire damage, magic plus one. I'm gonna give myself magic plus one. Cool, luck charm. I'll give you agility. Junpei's alright, strength one. Power band, take away. I'll give you luck, I guess. I'll give you strength. Mitsuru, fancy nails. Fake nails adorned with beautiful jewels. Gorgeous and elegant. That's fine. Luck, agility. I'll give you agility. I'll give you speed. Cool. Cool. All right. Oh. Do you know when you hit an enemy's weak point and they fall down? Some of them look so funny like that. It almost makes me want to laugh. But it wouldn't be funny if we got attacked while we were laughing, huh? No, it wouldn't. Ready when you are. Let me think about it. Oh yeah, I haven't chosen people. Hey. I wish there was a convenience to inside. Yep, we've had this before. Let me think about it. Hmm. Shadow spawn without limit here. In terms of sheer numbers, we've got the upper hand. To offset our disadvantage, we'll have to strategize, exploit weaknesses, for example. But the first strike is crucial. Don't let them see you coming. Let's go together. That's what I like to hear. Hmm. Don't hesitate to retreat if you're feeling exhausted. It's best not to overexert yourself. A real leader knows when to surrender. Well, the French within you is beginning to show. Would you like me to accompany you? Yes. I won't let you down. Oh. Da da da. Stand on standby? What do you mean on standby? I want to bring you along. Alright, let's jump in. Thanks to Yamagishi, I can explore with you too. But I'd still like to stick to the four person strategy. Just so we have backup or anyone who could come to our aid in the event of an emergency. And don't forget what happened during the last full moon. We can't leave Yamagishi alone. I'll leave it up to you to decide on the party members. I know you can handle it. 
Hey, didn't Junpei say he wanted to spend time with her? I'll do everything I can to help. Let's give it our best. You can decide who to take into combat at locations where you can change party members, such as entrance. You can change party members by talking to your teammates or by opening the menu and selecting status. Right, second block. Oh, that's what they mean. So this is block one. No, wait. Block one, block two. Okay, so this is block two. I think. Right? Block two. Alright, two block. One block. Okay, fair enough. It tells me all good! So we need something dropped in the back half of the purple area. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. 42nd floor. Do you have a moment? I'd like to share something I found about using Therogy. Can't be used just any time. The user has to reach an emotional peak first. In other words, can only be used after enough power has built up. Also, how someone builds up the power is different depending on the person. For Kirijo Senpai, it's when she inflicts status ailments on the enemy. But for Yukari, it's when she heals someone. Try different things and see what works. Therogy is very powerful. We'll definitely want to use it as much as we can. Will increase throughout the battle whenever you attack or summon a persona. How much the gauge increases will vary from ally to ally. Act accordingly to party member personalities will cause their gauge to increase. Buka also has a gauge. Once it's max, you will be able to activate her ability during a party's turn. However, the gauge will stop increasing when you get inflicted with a status ailment or it will drop by half whenever you get KO'd. I found a rarity fortune read today. Apparently, I will face an adversary clad in gold. Maybe I'll run into a rare enemy. Let's do it. Alright, works for me. What? This was a free floor. Let's do it. Are you watching your health and stamina? Remember not to push yourself too hard. We just got in here. Uh-huh. Now this is a dead end. You should be able to get past it. Could you check? That works for me. Here it is. Please watch out. <sighs> Looks like it's shaking has subsided. Is everyone alright? The path towards the staircase has opened. You can now advance further. We don't know what's waiting ahead, so please be careful okay. going forward. Alright. I wonder what the next area is going to be like. So that's the third area. Um. So basically, I still have to grind to get my thing here. Um. Use the teleporter. So this is going to take me to the third area above this. Oh my god. So I have to basically find a snake lady in the second area. Ugh. Fine. Let's find the snake lady. Actually, they said second half of the area. So technically 36 to 42. Alright, let's find the snake lady. We opened these up already. Slimy sound? Ugh, that's disgusting. The fortune teller mentioned I will face an adversary in gold. Maybe I'll run into a rare enemy. Maybe indeed. Damn it, don't give away our position. Quick, everyone hit it very hard. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Thank God for that. Huh. That was a good workout. 
It's a miracle Yamagishi was able to survive for as long as she did, all by herself. Metal protector. Not bad. Mind if I use it? Go for it. Yukari or... No, you need new equipment. I appreciate it. No substitute for training, but I'll take solid gear when I can find it too. Yukari can get the next one. I think this... Yeah, 70. Yeah, I think he should wear it. He's lower level. The girls are carrying the battle. Shadow spotted. What's the plan? Oh my god, I just realized. Who's the other character that we have seen recently that likes to fill his team with girls? I'll give you a hint. He likes rock music. Let the battle begin. No effect on this enemy. Dante? <laughs> no, Adam. Super shovel time. Didn't I already have an archangel? Poisma. I'm pretty sure I have an archangel somewhere. But I just got a new card. Wizard's Good candlestick. Teamwork, everyone. Now on to the next. All right. Excellent. Looks like we can. Let's keep going. Where's that snake lady? That teleporter can take us to the entrance. Try to remember where it is. Oh. Where's that snake lady? Oh, God damn it. It's because it's the last persona I used. It's going to take a while. I can't hear this song without Wario singing over it. Why would Wario be singing over this song? Whole party will have 50% or slime. But I don't want slime. No one wants slime. Slime sucks. I mean, I can buy this guy back. I'm just gonna get slime because I might need it. I, it's not like I want slime. Wait, did I just get the turquoise I needed? No, it's not the turquoise I need. I need the other thing. What was I actually gonna do? I, I thought I was gonna do something, but I forgot to do it. Right, yes, I remember. So... Light damage to all foes. Principality. Uh, bam. Oh yeah, right. I can reorder their abilities, can't I? He's already equipped. Uh, stats. I can reorder the abilities, right? 
Wait. Works for me. I just remembered I could do that. There's a shadow. Smack! She does pretty good base damage. Looks like fire will work great. What to do? See what I miss? Mr. He Ho is the best. It's a mistranslation that Atlas did. Akihiko ups his thing when he gets buffed, not when he buffs. Right. Slime. But I don't want slime. No one wants slime. God dang it. Slime's level 13. Myself a favor. Entrance. Slime boy. Register. Welcome to the velvet room. I don't even know why I'm registering slime boy, but I want to do it because he just got a level. Registering personas? Is overriding. I've completed registration. Very well. I don't think they all leveled up, but I did we make a few changes. And now I can go back to the same floor that I was, and I'm gonna find Snake Lady. <laughs> I'd laugh if we encounter Snake Lady from Bloody SMT5. I'm like, wait, I didn't know you were a persona. Um. 43rd? No, I think we were on like. No, we were like here. Get a head off. All good, man. Be good. Thanks for dropping by. Best to stay on your toes here. Yeah, we went through this one. We'll find Snake Lady you know, soon. This place reminds me of a movie I saw before. Um, what's it called again? I don't want to know. It's probably a horror movie anyway. Hey, Yukari, let's go watch a horror movie. I want to miss my chance. Go first. Yeah, let's try it. Restore 50% HP, increase accuracy for all allies. No. Deals almighty damage to all foes. Okay, so I will save it for later because I know I can hit all these guys. On shuffle time. Zero. Ooh, I get thunder. I think I was missing that one. I think I was Good missing that work, one. Everyone. Now on to the next. I think I was missing that one. Yeah, I was missing that one. Cool. Things are looking up. Come on, where's Snake Lady? Best to stay on your toes here. Come on, Snake Lady. There's a shadow. 
Ah, these guys again. Oh, this is saving us so much time. See, that was a good choice. Alright, Kirujo's probably going first because her agility is high. Nigi Mitama. Isn't Nigi Mitama like really useful for fusions? Let's release Slime. Yes, he's level 16. Let's do the same thing for our next fight. He'll level up quickly. He's only had like four fights when he leveled up. He'll be fine. Shadow up ahead. Taking it out. He won't know it I'll do it now. No! That is awesome shit. That is awesome shit. They are awesome. It must be because I have their two hearts. I actually like that one. All right, let's get moving. That was cool. That was Jack Brothers. That was cool. All right, let's continue. Where the heck is Snake Lady? Shadow, what will you do? We've got the enemy soon. I'm still setting up. It'll take a little more time. That is fine. Is this guy my only wind attack? Attack damage will increase until you leave Tartarus today. Rebellion. Money. Yes, please. All out attack damage is going to come in handy when I do a floor boss. 100%. That is good. 100%. Good teamwork, everyone. Now on to the next. That's probably one of the better bonuses I could get. 100%. There's a shadow. Oh, these guys. Yukari, you're up. Owned. Yukari, nice work. Ah, oh, it's the dog. I think I already have deer. I think. Own two. Oh, thank God for that. I thought I already had the dog. I already adopted the dog last time. Hanged man. Oh, I do have a hanged man, but it's not new. So I do have a hanged one when I need it. Cool, that works for me. So when I need to use the hanged one, I actually have one. That's cool. That is cool. Is that? Yes, the the analysis. 
That is a lot of damage. Thunder and win. This guy is actually still useful. Because of his thunder and wind. Hammer. Hammer is... I don't have it. Yeah, I need it. I don't have it. It could be like instant, holy kill, whatever, but I don't have it. Wait, so, um, you're awesome, but you're missing wind. You have decrease attack, but you're missing wind. I can teach you wind later. Purifying rice? What? And also dark. So you got wind and... Oh, dang it. I mean, one persona can't have all the combos. Like, that would be my go-to persona. Is that treasure? Awesome. Okay. Found the stairs. I was promised Snake Lady in the second block. Someone Hope lied to me. Any creeps here. Shadow up ahead. Hey, what's the difference between a creep and a chad? Attractiveness. See, if I do the AoE attack, I don't think it will count, and I wouldn't be able to path to Yukari because two of them are not weak to it. Let's test it. Let's test it. Right, and I can pass it. Okay, so this works. It didn't work in Persona 5, so they changed that. In Persona 5, if one of the people wasn't weak to an AoE, it wouldn't count as a button pass. But in this case, it does. So this game is more for giving than P5. Cool. I can work with this. Bufu. Do I have this in my inventory? Valkyrie leveled up. Let's do the same thing for our next fight. Cool. That's gonna be the stairs, isn't it? Found the stairs. Wanna climb up? Hey, there's a Hi, Great target. Hi. You're weak, but don't be careless. I'm this one's weak to up. shadow. We'll take a little more time. Thunder and wind. Wolf. Shadow Thunder. Shadow Thunder and Wind. See what I mean? The she utility is insane. Look at that utility. Look at that utility. This guy's just OP. Unbeatable. Dog. Bufu. Money. I remember if I mentioned that in OG3, darkness and light spells did only insta-kill. They were useless on bosses. Well, bosses typically are um, immune to insta-kill because it would make it too easy. Work. You would just reset the boss fight and keep using it. 
Although then you've basically got rid of two entire affinities, which kind of, you know, sucks. So it makes sense that they added the attack version as well. Because it's two attack types. It makes sense. I think we've seen everything on this floor right now. Yeah, All pretty right, much that. Let's head to the next floor. Mm. Because light is super effective against dark, and dark is super effective against light. So it's just like two affinities you add that cancel each other out gameplay-wise. It just makes sense. Is this it? Hey, there's a treasure chest. Sometimes when crossing through Tartarus, an indescribable fear overwhelms me. I feel that way all the time. I guess I kind of got used to it by now. What's that? I never took you as the type, showing, vul uh, showing vulnerability. That teleporter can take us to the entrance. Try to remember where it is. Uh huh. I never really expected Kiruja to show weakness in front of her teammates. Careful. Yeah, but the point is that it made characters that use them pretty much useless when fighting bosses. Sounds about right. What to do? Oh god, dang it! Did I just insta-kill it? Whoops. I wanted to use the attack that just hit it, but I accidentally insta-killed it. I guess that's okay too. Uh, Bufu. Yeah, get more XP. I think I had a Nigi Mitama before, so I'm not going to override this one over my old one. And there's a rare chest this way. And I've got my thing ready to go when you I need it. don't see that kind of chest up. Damn it, it's not the thing that I needed. Where is that damn snake lady? Plus, I'm running low on SP. Oh crap! Strong shadow. What's the plan? RUN! Wait, what if that was the snake lady? I don't know, I don't want to risk it for the biscuit. What? All oh, right, she's basically ready to go, but I don't want to use her SP. I'm gonna save it for the boss fight. I don't know how insta kill works in P3, but in P4 it had 100% if it was weak to it. In this chance, it's low. But I don't know if it's weak to it, but it seems so. XP, money. Give me money. Perfect. Just. I don't know if that high level mob could be the snake lady that I need. But at the same time, it would be detrimental if I accidentally encountered a high level mob and I got killed. Like it would be really bad. So I don't really want to risk it. Because I made progress. I don't know if I can go down and come back to the same floor. I doubt it though. Um. 
Yeah, I'm gonna save my process and then try to fight it, just in case. Because it could be the snake lady that I'm looking for. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Use personas. Save. Registering personas. Can I compare? Registered stats, current stats. All right, it makes sense to register all of them. Is acceptable? I've completed registration. I twitch. Cool. And if me, I use too. temperance with one of my chariots, I would get a naga or a naga. Are you finished? We look. All right. Let's see if, if that heavy boss. Thing is the snake lady. Probably is. Probably is. They mentioned you mentioned the snake Good lady day. that wanders, right? Request. Are you accepting a request? Um. Oh no, it's the crystal thing. Bring me sword. You may find it within a special treasure chest on the lower floors of Ark. The second belong in Tartarus. Tread carefully. Powerful. Right, so this is in a treasure chest. Right, so that's gonna be in a treasure chest. Wow, GG. So I needed to do the lower levels too of the second. Oh my god, I'm gonna. Ugh, the second block. Lower levels of the second. Okay, so let's go with it. Let's just encounter that big enemy. Well, I opened up the chest in these higher levels, so I can just... There's a shadow. I can probably ignore these ones. And just hit the heavy hitter. Which will be up on the higher floor. We gotta keep moving. Uh, straight ahead. I want to drain their bloody SP, but at the same time, there's four of them. So that would cause a lot of problems. Maybe if there's like two or three of them. Uh, two of those, slime. The whole party's defense will increase at the start of the next battle. I'll take the defense then. No one wants slime boy. Perfect. Just what we hoped for. Next battle will get defense. Works for me. There's a shadow. It's not the strong one, so it doesn't really matter. Now what do we run into next? We do not know. About those treasure traps. Oops, I like that dialogue, but yeah, this works. Come. Only 15, but better than nothing. Oh yeah, I'm gonna drain your SP. They had like no SP. Ouch. And there they were just dancing and we beat them up. I actually need Unicorn. The ST and MA personas in your possession will increase by two. Ah, this is a nice boost. 
I want Unicorn, but this is a nice boost. The strength and magic personas in possession have increased. Okay, let's keep on exploring. That was a nice boost, I couldn't say no. That looks dangerous. A shadow. Snake lady? Nope. I'm just gonna drain the crap out of your SP. That was free SP. Valkyrie. Perfect. Just what we hoped for. Well, that wasn't the snake lady. Okay, no matter. We might encounter snake lady soon. And I've already got um, MC's maxed out thing to hit it hard. So we should be okay. Oh, rare shadows. Oh, crap. It's a rare shadow. There's two of them. Don't you dare dodge that. Accuracy and evasion for three turns. Well, I shouldn't be able to miss it after this. It should basically be screwed now. And it's weak to light? Oh, this is gonna be easy then. Did we just one shot it? All right, who's next? Hey, isn't that one different from the others? Crap! Hey. No, Do your best to take it down. We're fine. Low chance of light insta- Oh, insta- Whoops, that was insta-kill. I kept spamming the insta-kill at the first slot. My bad. I thought it was the, like, low damage one, not the insta-kill on the first slot. That's my bad. I don't know if insta-kill was low chance or 100% chance because it was weak to it. I don't know. Uh, personas in your possession. See, this is pretty good. I can't say no. I mean, all our personas just got a massive boost. So this guy's stat is like 23 now. I should probably fix that mistake with Principality. Yeah. Cool. Problem fixed. Come on. Wherefore art thou, snake lady? Come on, snake lady. That one's blinking. So that's either a rare or a snake lady. There's a shadow. These guys again. This 
guy's getting a level up again. That was excellent leadership. Keep up the good work. All right, this is either a rare or a strong one. I got to get it by surprise. Crap. This is real. No, that's not a snake lady. Do the thing. No, not like do the thing to this thing. Full analysis, yes. What do you mean I can't do a full analysis? Is this a full analysis? It's not analysis, is it? Is this a full analysis? No, that wasn't full. All oh, right, full analysis has to be after the first turn. Okay, well, I did what I did. I uh, just hit it very fast and very hard. Just keep hitting it hard! Boom! Alright, that wasn't a snake lady though. Went off without a hitch. Okay, that wasn't snake lady. I thought that could have been snake lady, so clearly that wasn't snake lady. So where the hell is snake lady? It said the upper half of the second thing, right? Where the literal hell? What to do? I'm just gonna steal more SP. Can't attack. Love my spirit ring. Alright, now you guys are all useless. Are we in upper half? Yeah. We're like in the last one, two things. Suku Kaja own zero. All right, picking up another card that I don't have. Looks like I'm getting even stronger. Shock boost is good. Now then, let's get back to work. We're definitely in the upper half. We're on 41st floor, and 43rd floor is our maximum floor. So we're definitely in the upper half. I don't know what's going on though. I would think that the snake lady would appear somewhere. See? Like... What? Like what the hell? 
And above this is all new progress. We need Snake Lady for something? A mission, yeah. I think they could have made a mistake. It might be the lower half. There must be a mistranslation somewhere. And they seem to have mistranslated Akihiko's Welcome description. The they must have mistranslated a mission description as well. Registering per Will you pretty register bad. To the compendium? I've completed registration. Are you finished? I have a feeling she might be in the lower half. We look I think it's said in the lower half. That was for the um, item itself. It's in the loot boxes in the lower half. She was supposed to be in the upper half. Um. So it's supposed to be like... Here. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go on the 43rd floor. And then when my SP gets low, I'm gonna drop to the 28th floor. Do the lower half by stealing SP and then jump back to the higher floor. That sounds like a strategy. Because I'm going to get low on SP. I'm not going to be able to go all the way to the floor boss without having to refresh my SP. But I don't want to be refreshing SP in hard fights. You want to refresh SP in easy fights. Thank you. I remember how helpless I felt being here alone. Oh, there's a treasure chest! Treasure chest to say. That chest looks like it's worth opening. All right, let's see the new enemies. I'm still setting up. It'll take a little more time. These guys are new. One more. Oh, they hit hard. Wait, do I have Spirit Drain on Mr. Fire? I do. Oof. All right, my SP's back up. All right, my SP's back to full. Were you trying to hit me? Oh my God, she's simping. It's still Arca, this floor I mean. Ah, oh, so Arca is like multiple things? I think this is in my possession. Counter. Ooh, I should pick up counter. Power's grown. You can now have up to 10 personas. Sweet! Oh, hello. We secured a perimeter. We still have some time to spare before the next shadow appears. It should be safe for you to scout ahead. What do you mean? That's... One person will spread from the party to scout the floor. Exploring would be more efficient if we divide and conquer. Going solo makes it easier to evade shadows as well. And if the scout can locate the stairs, it would make everyone's lives easier. What do you think? Should we ask someone to scout? Salut. Allow me. Don't worry, I'll clear us the path. Okay. After combat, you may have the opportunity to scout if you decide to scout the area. One of your teammates will temporarily leave your party and look for a path to the next floor. The allies scouting ahead will also collect items and hand over anything they've collected upon rejoining the party on the next floor. Note that you will be down a party member if you choose to scout. Now yeah, I've been down a party member for most of the game. I'm fine with that. So this is considered the upper half. So it basically has two halves. Okay. Wait a minute, give this to Yukari. Thanks. So the lower half we spent time in already. Okay. So we'll have to do the lower, lower half 
to get the loot box. And now we're in the upper half. That's fine. Uh, Enemy spotted. Let's take him down. This shouldn't be a problem. I'm still setting up. It'll take a little more time. Been hit. Focus. Let's try fire. Oh, 69. Where are they going for Yukari? Increase evasion against dice. Oh, he's got a lot of SP. Oh, damn it, he didn't dodge. So it does increase chance, but it doesn't make it that high. Okay, dokie. Let's test Thunder. Ah, it is weak to Thunder. I'll party the Bareth. I don't actually have this guy. Oh yeah, and I have an extra two slots. Sweet. Teamwork, everyone. That she did the scouting. Hello. Good. We're rendezvous. I've already gone ahead and done some reconnaissance. I found this. Put it to good use. Nice. Seems like you all met up safely. Thank you for scouting ahead. We so she scouted this floor. Cool. Hoping the next floor. Found a surge of power. Be careful. Yeah. Deal severe damage to one for ignoring resistances. Ah, crap! I can't use it yet. What's the plan here? I chance to charm, decrease defenses. I hope this doesn't go badly. Ah, crap! Please be weak. Manageable. It's got a lot of SP. Resistant to physical attacks. Oof. That is savage. Pull the trigger. 
Bastard. Oh, he was weak to wind? Or maybe just ignored everything. Three of the item protection sutra. Dodge light, which is useful. Maximum thing. Uh, give me that one. Excellent leadership. Keep up. That was a little bit reckless on my thing, just jumping into a heavy attack. Wait, can I do like the non AoE version? Do I not have the non AoE heal? Restore party HP, restore single HP. So principality, can you learn it? Stop simping. Oh crap, that didn't give me my... Oh no, there was a second enemy. I didn't see the second enemy. I'm an idiot. I didn't see the second enemy. I'm blind. I didn't see the second one at all. I mean, even though they're technically under level, they're not that bad. Their stats more than compensate for their lack of level. See, and I don't have this one, so I'll take this one. So now I've got another Persona for free. At this point, I'm just collecting them. Excellent leadership. They're just Pokemon at this point. We could head back. It's your call. Ah, uh, we're good. Ooh, what is this? There's a chest. Just more of this. Oh, stairs! Stairs work. Ooh! Great! It's got magical fingers. Guys, so this will give him XP. Let's do the same thing for our next fight. More money. I think I've finally gotten used to the atmosphere here. Yeah. 
There's a trench. More money. Works for me. Oh, you bastard! Oh no! Oh my god! What do you mean you don't know what his weakness is? Fine then. I'll use this. Okay, as death. How did hell we miss? I hate my life. Thank you! She's as death. She's bloody as death. Alright, let's continue. I've learned a new skill. A victory well earned. Alright, onwards. And we're primed for the next special attack. Oh! Powerful enemy spotted! Please be careful! Please tell me we can actually save. Going against another gaper won't be an easy fight. You can do this. I'll do my best to support you. With my full analysis, I'll be able to give you a complete breakdown of the enemy's weakness. And remember, I can use it as well. Stay safe. See, if we're up here, then that means we've already reached the next floor guardian. Once Fuka's theology gauge is max, press middle to activate. Oracle during the party's turn. Using Oracle will benefit the party in battle with HP recovery, SP recovery, and stat buffs. Oracle can be activated during any party member's turn and try to use it when you feel the time is right. 47. Ah, so this is still this area. Okay. Got it. Alright, so let me get some recovery back. And let's prime as well. Alright, let's do a few lower levels, get some SP back, get everyone's ability primed, and then we jump in. And this way we can actually get that item from these lower lockboxes. These mission requests. Remind me, can't you TP to the next floor from any spot after finding stairs? To any floor? I don't think it's to any floor, I think it's from the transporter. Once you find the stairs, you can just go to the next floor. And then you can teleport to, like, a teleporter. Is actually kind of pretty. I mean, the upper floor. There's a you mean the highest floor you've been to? Yes. Because it's a teleporter. I always come down at a teleporter floor. And you have to use a teleporter to come down. So you'll always be able to go to that floor. Even if we're able to head upstairs, we should try to take out as many enemies as we can. Huh? Wouldn't it be better to avoid unnecessary conflict? Doesn't that one look pretty... 
Oh crap! I won't miss my chance. Level 14? We should be okay. Whoa, he's targeting her. Well, there goes his attack. Nani? Oh, God. In this situation. Yes! Once you find you can just go straight up to the next door on your map. Oh, you mean once you've found the stairs, anywhere on that floor you can go up to the next floor. Uh, experience from Bowser will increase until you leave. Yes. We can try that. Yay, got the burst. Patra money. I think Patra is good. Here, we'll test it. Do you want to send someone to scout ahead? Let's not. Can we go up those stairs? And what about the item that we needed for the other quest? What about this one? We might as well ask for help. Um, this one. Onimaru kun itsuna. I was told that it can be found in a special treasure chest on the lower floors of Arca, the second block in Tartarus. And I believe I am in the lower floors because I'm on like level 34. Fifty-four for special chest. But isn't the lustful snake in the upper floors which is fifty-four? And now fifty-four for the special chest, but it's saying the lower floors. Is that a mistranslation? Above fifty-four. This quest hint is, like, the worst. I'm just saying. Lower floors, but it's 54. That is ridiculous. Without teleporters, it'd be even more difficult to explore this place. So it's not a lower floor, it's 54. Wow, it lied to me. The game lied to me. Okay. Let's just heal up then. The weapons to show are in special boxes that are mostly near a gatekeeper, I believe. Man, they say lower floors, so you think the lower floor would be the lower half. But it's actually not. It's 54, which is towards the upper. Okay. Wow, that is so misleading. Welcome to the Velvet Room. That is so misleading. But okay. Registering, I see. That's Will just register, register everything. The I've completed registration. Very well. We look. Yeah, all of them. If it says I sense a powerful shadow nearby, it's a guardian reward. Wow. Okay. Let's take a quick break and take out the guardian then. We're gonna do the guardian. We should be able to do it. Save the game. Got enough MP and all that. We should be able to take them out. Quick little break and we'll do the guardian. Alright, that was my bad. I thought lower levels meant lower levels, but I guess it doesn't. So, we should be okay. At least now our party members are not underleveled. So like, should be fine. 19, 19, 17, 21, 19, 20. Fairly close to each other. Should be fine. 
Let's try the floor boss. Should be alright. And then I gotta go up all the way to 54. Wow. 54 is considered a lower level. Okay. Whatever. You know what I should actually do? What was that persona that had the automatic thing? Auto... Auro... Tarakaja. Yeah. Let's start with this guy. Highly unlikely they use wind. Enemy is strong. Please make sure you're ready before fighting. Let's do it. Alright, let's do this. Let's our way through. Three enemies! Be careful! What's the plan here? High chance to charm, decrease defenses. the attack so that nullifies the increase in attack Oh, it's frozen! That's a lot of XP. 7,000? I get like 100 for killing normal mobs. This gave me 7,000? Jesus! That's multiple levels. Can't let my guard down, especially not around those gatekeepers. I've never seen you with your guard down though, not even in the dorm. When you're up late on a mission, I've never seen you yawn, much less doze off. Then the next day, you're all dressed up and drinking black tea before heading to school 15 minutes later. You're so... You're sure observant. I should follow your lead. Seems exhausting. You're sure observant. Huh? Uh, not really. When you live in the same dorm, you start to pick some things up. No. Once it becomes a habit, it's all second nature. Besides, wouldn't you find it offensive if I were to take it easy? After all, I'm the one who asked you all to attempt the impossible when taking part in these club activities. Huh? Oh yeah, this still classifies as a club. Asking us, huh? What's the matter? Oh, um, nothing. <laughs> she doesn't think she was asked to join, but rather that she was conscripted. Come on, Lita. We're beating them, so let's move. Hurry, to uh, clock's ticking. No wonder she wants to give the other girl a chance to say no. She feels that she never had the I'm chance up some signals on her own. Shadows. I'll let you know when I pinpoint their location. Oh, Stronger Shadows sounds good. Chewing Souls. Boxing Shoes. Not bad. I appreciate Cool. Up we go. We gotta keep moving.
Luckily, expected. My abilities are much better suited for the front lines. You don't necessarily have to kill. Oh God, I did this. Ah, God! I'll hit them where it hurts. In this situation, I wonder if there's a different dialogue for having Junpei, Aki, and Mitsuru, or Mitsuru, Junpei, Yukari. I think that would be. It would make sense. Yeah, my win guy is here. Oh no, this is 16. He's 18 though. But I can't go all out, can I? Can I stand on this enemy? Yeah, I can't go all out. Kind of annoying. Is this the DMC theme? Wow. So that entire boss fight I did means nothing because I didn't go down to save afterwards. GG. JJ. Yeah, I was uh, avoiding those particularly tough ones because there's always a risk of this happening. And of course it happened. And it wasn't even a critical hit. It was just like, you dead. What? No. Then give me title screen. Then I'll just load. Oh, whoops. I should have gone down to save afterwards. GG. That's what you get. GG. Oh no, that's not what I... No, doesn't matter. Whatever. I think it was weak to win. No, whoops. Say I don't remember. Be on your guard. I have to do this. The best bet. Are we doing this? Stop buffing him, damn it. No, oh, he's getting targeted hard. Alright. Can I stand on this enemy? 
I don't remember what you're actually weak to, but... This fight is now harder than the first time I did it. What's happening? Stop being confused. a money distributor. Nah! Oh yeah, I'm weak to that crap. Hey, this didn't happen last time. Um, high chance of fear, high chance of confuse. Follow her lead. No. Once it becomes a habit, it's all second nature. So it's the same dialogue. All right, I should probably go and save, so I don't have to deal with that again. Signals of stronger shadows. I'll let you know when I pinpoint their location. Yeah, well, they kicked my butt last time. Let's try not to make an embarrassment of ourselves. And let's save our personas really quickly. Well, that was humbling. Welcome to the Velvet Room. And I was doing so well. Oh well. Registering is overriding acceptable. All registered. Very well. We look All right, back into the giant tower of death we go. You spin me right round. Um. 47th, continue. All right, let's not do the crazy hard mobs, yeah? Cool. That was stupid of me. Should have just tried to run. I'm picking up some signals of stronger shadows. I'll let you know when I pinpoint their location. Oh yeah, and this is going to be the boxing shoes. Not bad. I cool. Up we go, aboard the pillar man. There's no room for carelessness. Stay alert. Yeah, tell me about it. There's a treasure. All right, we got some money back. Shadow spotted. What's the plan? 
this shadow is not strong, so we should be okay. Wait a minute, I fought this guy before. We have the advantage. Be on your guard. No, it's not weak to win. Alright, who's next? So this is where the stairs were. Uh-huh. Up we go. Okay. It's not 54, so it's not this one yet. Electricity. It worked. All right, electricity worked. I think I have one in my possession. Ice break. But I don't have one of these. So let's collect the cards that we don't have. Perfect. Kill. There are so many twists and turns here. Be careful you don't get ambushed by any shadows. Ah, <laughs> too late for that. Oh, that one, the hot. Oh, no, you don't. I'm gonna avoid that, that one. Shadow looks way too strong. Thank you! I never could have possibly guessed on my own the hard way. Where were you five minutes ago when I needed you? Ah, no, not this one either. Too bad I just ran into that strong shadow. 50th floor, but we're still a ways to go. Tell me about it. Shadow up ahead. Taking it out? Um... Necessarily. There's a treasure chest. What should we do? Okay. That chest. Come on, the item I need. Ugh. Just more spell attacks. Hey, lifestone's 30% of my health. That's handy. That is handy. Nothing more on this floor. We found the stairs. All right, we're almost up to 54. We're doing well. Let's keep up the pace. There's a shadow. There's a strong one. Be on your guard. Wake to ice, huh? Never mind. Uh, never mind. Enemy, switch to ice. I'm still setting up. It'll take a little more time. How about electricity? Nope. 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 Enemy oh, damn it, he knocked us down. Bastard. Well, it died to an auto attack. I feel like Gunpei is the easiest character to feel 
Thurgy with just crits, so in any other words, hit enemies. And his crit attack is high, so... Yeah, I guess that works. But utility-wise, he's fire. You already noticed this, but those shadows wandering around will always appear. Let's... Yeah. There's a shadow! It's one of those chests. Come on, be the one I need. No, Malankite. Uh -huh. That's a one-way teleporter. But there's no need to head back yet. Tell me about it. So this is where the stairs were. She gets like half her gauge for a party heal. Really? Oh, there's a treasure chest. But that would just eat up your SP. One person's primed. A shadow. I'll be able to scan the enemy soon. Oh, these are new ones. But they've got a lot of that, so maybe they're weak to ice. Let's try it. Makes sense. I like when there's logic to them. What's this? Mahama. That sounds good. That if we could build our endurance, we wouldn't lose as much stamina while we're on the move. You don't say. Come on, be the item. Oh my god, it's not the item I need. Shadow up ahead. So your thunder, your ice, and your ice. Thunder, ice, ice. I mean, MC's got all of those. He's got thunder and ice. Done and done. And I think his special ability will be primed soon. I'm just gonna save it for the next floor boss. Or the next emergency that we have. I don't want us dying again. What's this? Obtain money. Ice break. I already have one. XP will increase. Give me this one. Money. 3,000. Okay. That's something. Right, 54. There's a strong enemy on the next floor. Be careful. Best to stay on your toes here. Are we able to go down a level now that there's the strong one on 54? It's one of those chests. Should have a one-way teleporter down, I hope. Even though the floors all look the same, let's try not to run ourselves ragged. Oh crap! No, 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 You must be fearless. No, I've got a floor boss coming up. I don't want to waste it. I need to be strategic. One of those chests. So this one's ice, and this one's thunder. Okay, now we can actually use our special ability. Uh, 
Ice break, money, hiero. I have one of these, then. Eh? So my higher offense just got a level. Cool. Dodge fire. Do the same thing for our next fight. That'll be handy. All right. Oh, that sounded like Hachan got home. I gotta dodge this one. Dodge him. I'm running. Okay, it's the weak one that hit me. I should be all right. I should be all right. I hope to God I'm all right. I'm not all right. This is horrible. Why does this keep happening? Can go with you when it's sundown. It's too hot. <sighs> Alright. I don't know if Ice will make him wake. Dang it! I feel like I need some SP. I think that jump hit would be best for Kuma's SP saving strategy as long as the basic attack crits. Yeah, but then I'd be leveling up someone that I don't intend to use long term. Dodge strike. I'll grab one of these. That certainly went well. Yeah. I need to get some SP before the next. We heading up these stairs? Oh god, I don't have a choice, do I? Powerful enemy spotted! Please be careful! I definitely want to be primed yeah. with more than one character. <laughs> definitely gonna go to the first floor and save. Definitely gonna heal up. Let's go register personas. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Registering per is overriding acceptable. I've completed registration. Are Looks you finished? We look. All right. I feel like Yukari's gonna be primed as soon as she does a heal. What does it actually say? Uh, L2. After summoning a persona, 
After healing someone. After landing a crit. After strengthening himself. Apparently, it's after someone strengthens him. After weakening enemies or inflicting it out. Well, that's not gonna help, considering I'm not using your SP. After analyzing your enemy. Okay. Cool. I should hopefully have the SP required for the next boss fight. Alright, let's do it. How much SP do I have? 48, should be enough. The enemy is strong, please make sure you're ready. Let's do it. Alright, let's do this. Preparing to analyze. I could just buff all of us at the beginning. Yeah, you're not going to be around long enough to use that attack. And done. Well, that went better than expected. Gatekeep eliminated. No other shadow activity detected in the vicinity. Roger that. Seems like we'll be able to take a small breather here. You sure look happy today, Mitsuru. Let me guess. You had a lot of stress pent up from being stuck as support this whole time. Not that. Not at all. I just... I was just thinking about how Yama Gishi sounded so dependable. Huh? I do? The connection is stable. You are accurate... And you accurately predict the shadow's locations too. You're exactly what we need, don't you think so? She's a huge help. <laughs> I miss your voice though. <laughs> Even though I'm speaking right now, though I should be glad you didn't say I was annoying. But if you were to put me on the front lines, I'd certainly give you an earful. Now that we're all rested, shall we keep going? Okay, I've got your back. So let's move out once everyone's ready. Cool. So let's save. I think my visual field has expanded a little. Maybe I've gotten used to this. Oh my! What do we have here? Currently you appear to possess a great number of personas. Quite impressive. However, perhaps in your current state, you are able to utilize even more powerful personas. Should you be so inclined, please make your way to the Velvet Room. Sorry, you want to give me more powerful personas? How can I say no? Oh, what do you mean by this? Welcome to the Velvet Room. How may I help you? Well, tell me about that more powerful persona thing you're talking about. Where is it? No? How may I assist you? Or are you just telling me just to fuse things? Ah, fusion is... Registering, I see. Will you register it to the com I've completed registration? Maybe Very she's well. talking about doing a special fusion. Special fusion? Are you in it is a special persona you desire, is it not? Yeah, so if I get Unicorn, I can do this one. I can do Pale Rider with a Metador. An Eligor, I can do a Floros. With a King Frost, I can do a Black Frost. Accept yeah, these yourself. are all within reach. Accept but I don't know what she was actually talking about. Will you choose? I don't know exactly what she was referring to. 
Because she didn't mention anything. What kind of persona do you can't control this one yet? So what was she talking about? I have no idea what she was on about. This power might be too much for you. I have no idea what she was on about. Are you finished? We look I think they were just hinting that I should fuse personas. Which I've been doing this entire time. Alright, we made good progress. It's six hours. We should wait there. Next time when we continue, we can do some more... Tartarus. And then we can do more social links and story. Because I feel like the next push is going to take a few more hours. And we're already at, like, time. So we should cut it there. It's been good. We made some progress. We died. That sucks, but it is what it is. So it's been fun. We made some good progress, I think. So, yeah. I don't want to rush the next few floors. I don't want to screw up the next few floors. We'll take our time. We'll push it to the next block. We'll do the requests. So we should be fine. And we're not under leveled or anything, so it's perfectly fine. And then we could just like smash out the content probably to the next full moon. It seems to go that way. You do Tartarus, you do all your social links, you get your story, you get your full moon. And it just kind of cycles once a month in the story. So it's like not too bad. Alright guys, thank you for that. I will see you tomorrow. I think we're watching Dr. Stone tomorrow. Um, which should be good. And then I'll see you next weekend with more Persona 3 Reload. So till then, Ninja come out. Bye. Your notes are as perfect as ever. They're easier to understand than the textbook itself. Flattery will get you everywhere. <laughs> Flattery will get you nowhere. NOT THIS SHIT AGAIN! NOT THIS AGAIN! NO! WHY? WHY DOES THIS KEEP HAPPENING? <laughs> WHY DO YOU DO THIS TO ME, SIA 2.0? WHY? Why? Why am I getting rejected? Why? <laughs>